Uh, Shalom, first and foremost, so I'd give all praises, sing glory and honor to, to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Makakadash, and the uh, Heavenly Father, the true name is a Yahweh, and his only begotten son, by Hashem, the name of Mashiach Yahweh Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the last one, Kadash, the tongue. And I say Barakatham to the uh, elders, by Akima Akwaf, and I say Shalom. And this is a uh, quick sit down lesson of uh, John 80, verse 32. That's going to be the title of sit down lesson. And this is uh, the book of John, chapter 80, verse 32. And ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. For I treat the, the truth is being sprung forth uh, in the last days. Like it says, uh, John, uh, it says, uh, I meant to say, uh, Daniel's 2 and verse 4, knowledge, knowledge shall be increased. So that's what scripture says, uh, and ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. Especially, you know, the actual Israelites is coming back to who they actually are. The actual Israelites, the uh, 12 tribes of Israel, nor the kingdom and the southern king of the uh, 12 tribes of Israel. So that's why scripture says uh, in the last days, knowledge shall be increased. So knowledge is definitely going to continue to increase, especially, you know, the doctrine of the heavenly father, Yahweh, and his only begotten son, Hamashiach, Yahweh, of the knowledge is being increased. But the scripture says, uh, Isaiah 33 and verse 6, Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our times and the strength of salvation in the fear of the heavenly Father, Yahweh, thy palace of treasure. Because that's why it says, uh, 1 John 2 and verse 15, Learn, love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man loves the world, the love of the Father is not in him. But the scripture says, uh, the ways of this world is foolishness and the wisdom of this world is foolishness in the sight of heavenly father, Yahweh. And the God of this world have blind the minds of people that wish not believe. That's why in the last days it says in the book of Daniel 12, verse 4, knowledge, uh, knowledge shall be increased. So it makes perfect sense. Because that's why scripture says, uh, and ye shall know the truth, and the truth, the truth shall make you free. Because uh, truth is going to be is being sprung out in these last days. That's why knowledge, knowledge is increasing. Like I mentioned, Daniel 12, verse 4. John 8, verse 32, and you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. So with that, this is just a quick sit-down lesson of uh, John 8, verse 32. That was the title of the sit-down lesson. So with that, I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to, to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, and the Heavenly Father, the true name is like Yahweh, and this only begat Son, by Hashem, and the name of Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Uh, those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the last one, Kadash, the tongue. And I say, Barakatham to the uh, elders, while Akim or Akwaf. Until next time, I will say, Shalom.